If there's one thing I've learned over the years, it is that people often choose a main line based on the terminal tackle that they use. So if you have faith in one company's products, it's quite often the case that you will choose one of their main lines when spooling up. And if you're a thinking anglers fan, you like using their kit, then you'll be pleased to know that they now have a monofilament in their range. The OGX copolymer mainline is available in four braking strains. You've got a 12, a 15, an 18, and a 20. So whatever situation you need, whether it's super strong for short range or a thinner, more castable line for your long range fishing, you will have a braking strain that will suit the fishing you want, depending on the situation. That is always really important, especially when you're trying to cast a long way. You know, you need to have the right main line for the job. And the same goes for the strength side of things. If you're fishing a lake full of snags or weed, you need to have a strong line to stand the best chance of landing the fish. There's a few things that are important when choosing a main line, you know, must haves, I would call them. One of them is a line doesn't have too much stretch so that when you're feeling the lead down, you get a good resistance through the rod and you can feel properly what you're landing on. That for me is very important. This line has that. You've got the abrasion resistance. Once again, snags, weed, they can cause you problems. The last thing you want is to be getting cut off too easily. So a line with strong and good abrasion resistance is really important. This has that. It's got a steely gray color to it, which will suit pretty much every situation. The line sinks well, which is always important. And one other thing to point out is the line is actually underrated. So the 12 pound braking strain has a knot strength of 15 pounds. The 15 pound has a knot strength of 18 pounds. The 18 pound has a knot strength of 20, 21 pound. And the 20 pound has a knot strength of 24 pounds. So whatever it is you're buying, you're always gonna get a little bit more out of it in terms of the strength. It comes on 1000 meter spools, which is enough to do three reels quite comfortably. And there are line markers as you work your way through the spool to give you a good gauge of how much line you're putting onto each reel. So in a nutshell, a decent all round monofilament main line that will suit pretty much every situation that you could possibly need it for, depending on which braking strain that you buy. But as I said earlier, there are a variety of braking strains available. So whatever it is you need it for, you will find one spool that suits the job perfectly. And the spools are $21.99. And if you're a topography member, and you shop with Fish on Tackle, you can save yourself 10% using your member's discount code.